Hello, I am Danielle. You are listening to my YouTube channel, which depends on the generous donations of our listeners. Please support us. I, and I also hope that you will enjoy the music and the message after it.
it is written in the Bible in Malachi chapter 3 verse 2 to 3. The Lord is like a blazing fire that refines silver and gold, burning all impurities from them. Just like a goldsmith purifies gold, so does God sit and purifies his servants in the fire. In order to purify gold or silver from all other metals it might contain, a goldsmith must melt the metals in fire and increase its temperature so much that all other metals will evaporate. He must, however, be very careful not to allow the gold or silver itself to evaporate. So, the goldsmith sits and watches attentively. As the heat is raised, the gold at one point will start shining and the goldsmith will be able to see his own reflection in it. That is when he will know that it has been cleansed of all impurities. So does our God. He constantly tests us and purifies us. He puts us through fire with the aim of seeing Jesus in us in all circumstances. Indeed, God refines those whom he loves and chooses to be his own by means of all sorts of sorrows, trials, disappointments and temptations until he sees his son's reflection in us. For that, our hearts and lives will have to be passed through the fire. There is no other way of purifying them. It hurts to be burned, but we have no choice. If we refuse to bear our cross by escaping into the world's ways and the diversions it offers, we are making it clear to all, ourselves included, that we do not belong to Jesus. In 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 6 to 7, it is written, We have to suffer grief in all kinds of trials, so that just like gold that is tested in fire, our faith may be proven to be genuine and our lives will bring honor and praise to Jesus Christ. Amen.